So, funny story time. I, as you can tell, I'm in my rain gear. I have not worn this gear uh, since August of 2010. It has been sitting in my shed and it smells, it smells like the panty drawer at a nursing home. It's just disgusting, I'm gonna throw it away. I am tired, I'm beat down. I got rained on for about an hour. And then somewhere in the middle of Missouri, the clouds parted and the, the sky opened up and there was sunshine. And in the middle of the road, there was this rainbow and it literally went from one side of the road to the other. I mean, total Lucky Charm style. And I'm so tired and this is supposed to be this calming, inspirational, uplifting moment. And I swear, I looked at this thing and I thought in my head, Fuck you, Rainbow, get out of my way. And you know what happened? You know what happened after that? It started raining again. Morning, Trace. Morning, Billy. Where are we at and what did we do? We are in Spartanburg, South Carolina, uh, in the Great Smoky Mountains-ish, I think. Um, the mountains part, not Spartanburg. Uh, yesterday, we did 1,130? 39. 39 miles from Omaha, Nebraska, Billy's house, to here. Uh, we left Omaha at 6 a.m. We hit here at 2.30 local time, hour ahead since it's Eastern. But we're here, we're in Spartanburg, we iron butted it, we made it. Uh, we're both worse for the wear, we're feeling it, we're getting older of course, that sucks, that but whatever. Sucks, dude. But we made it and Billy has now accomplished two goals. He is now a thousand mile in a day traveled man and he's been to 40, count them, nine states. That Four. means there's one left and Four. we're getting that one in a month. 49 states. Yes sir. I tell you that. The iron butt kicked my ass. It seemed okay last night. I was I was really tired, and I wasn't really thinking about how how exhausted I was. I was just so tired, and just all I wanted to do was go to bed. But waking up this morning, I my ass is feels like a midget has just beat the shit out of me. My hand is literally numb, like uh, like dead, like pins and needles. My my back hurts. It's it's. It's a pretty brutal thing. I have uh, nothing but mad respect for those iron butt guys. I, I was, I thought the polar bear guys were tough, but they're, uh-uh, mm -mm. no. <laughs> okay, here we are on the side of the highway like we do. Um, we are now at state number 48, North Carolina. We're gonna cross, we stayed the night in South Carolina, but obviously it was too dark to, to take any video. So we've gotten all the states from a uh, technical standpoint, but we haven't officially brought it to you in this medium. So uh, North Carolina, rock on. Number 48 for me. And Tracy's already got his 50, so whatever. Hey guys, it's Billy here, and welcome um, to South Carolina. This is state number 49. We actually stopped at a rest area. We, we actually took the, the photos at the, the side of the road and I'll be honest I'm kind of glad we weren't videotaping them because I got a little choked up realizing that this is the last time me and the VFR are going to be stopping for a state sign so it was kind of an emotional experience that's 
tearing up a little bit. It's kind of crazy, but it's been a wacky, wild trip, and we earned an iron butt to get this, and uh, so it's it's a big deal. It's a big deal. State number 49, South Carolina. We will see you in probably about three and a half weeks. Well, it'll be about four weeks when we finally get to Alaska, so in about a month, we'll be completing all 50 states and the B1 project will be officially over. So it's been a good ride and uh, we'll see you on the road. What you doing there, Trace? Enjoying being in South Carolina. Yep. It's uh, warming up on us, it's a little hot out, but we're about to get back on the road. We're heading to Nashville. We're gonna meet up with the Smyrna Cowboy and have lunch with him. And then we're gonna split our separate ways from there and go home. Yep. Hey Trace. Hey Billy. Where are we at? We are in, I don't know, somewhere in North Carolina. Now Tennessee. We're, yeah, we're in Newport, Tennessee. We're in Newport, Tennessee, yes, thank you, that's correct. And what are you doing? I'm rearranging my pack. He's rearranging his pack. Do uh -huh. you have some cargo? Yes I am. That you want to when we were in, well, <laughs> England country, yeah. you get England. You gotta get England. So I gotta find a place to put it. Mm -mm. Where are we at there, Trace? We're on the western, the eastern outskirts of Nashville, Tennessee. And who did we stumble upon? We found the one and only Smyrna Cowboy. The Smyrna Hello. Cowboy. <laughs> How y'all doing? <laughs> it's my honor to meet these guys. I mean, these are just like the, the greatest vloggers on the planet, including ah. the solar system. Ah, shots, Dave. <laughs> Here's your time. <laughs> well, it's, it's good to meet these guys and finally meet these guys. I, I can scratch this off my bucket list. <laughs> we made a bucket list. Wow. <laughs> We just met up, ate an early dinner with the, the one and only the Smearing a Cowboy. Howdy! <laughs> Howdy y'all! And uh, yeah, Tracy and I are going to get back on the road. Um, we're going to separate. This is where we diverge. Well, yeah, we, we'll probably, we'll go on the same, I'll go on 40 for a while. Uh, for about another 10 miles. 10 miles and 10 then I'll, I'll be cutting north yeah. and uh, I'll be going solo, doing my solo b one thing and Tracy will be I don't know what he does. Whatever he does when he does. I don't want to tell you what I do. Yeah. But I thought it was kind of funny that uh -huh. we're meeting up with the Smyrna Cowboy and you're wearing a Downshift 83 shirt so and while yeah. we're in there, 808 YouTube texted me. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> so that's kind of, uh, you know, so it shows how small our community is. Absolutely. Yeah. And I'm wearing a Walmart uh, shopping cart dude vest. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's gainfully employed as a Walmart shopping cart dude. At least you won't get run over when you're loading up carts, right? That's right. Yeah. That's and, uh, right. Hold it there, buddy. <laughs> Welcome to Walmart. Get your crap and get out. <laughs> as you can see, this is Alf the Bergman 650. Which it's got a little boo boo here, a little duct tape on the uh, on the seat. Don't film that. <laughs> <Don't film. laughs> but Dave's getting a new seat soon, so uh. yeah, hopefully this week. Nice. <laughs> and Al's kind of embarrassingly all dolled up in Harley garb, but you know, at least he's being safe. Now y'all may have to hold your ears because you know loud pipes save lives. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> oh yeah, can you hear this? I can hear that. <laughs> there goes Alf. There goes Alf with Dave on board. Nice. And uh, yeah, that was cool. That was totally cool. Yeah, it was really cool. I'm, just... I'm glad we got to meet him. Yep, one more okay. vlogger down in my bucket list of guys I had to meet. So um, we're gonna basically part ways, I think, and. Uh, I'm gonna go see Superman. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I may just get the go crazy and ride home, but that's yeah. a long way. I doubt I will. Like that. Hey guys, it's Billy here. I apologize for the helmet. We're running out of daylight, and I just thought I would show you this. Check it out. <laughs> it's, it's a big old giant Superman. Uh, we're actually in Metropolis, of all places, Metropolis, Illinois. And uh, they have a Superman museum over here, but unfortunately it's not open. So it's pretty cool stuff, but I just thought I'd show you that. It's one of those funny kind of by way of motorcycle things. 
Check me out against it. That's right, Superman. Da, 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 da. Da, da. Oh. Da, da.